Hello, good day everyone. I'm Tebs. Welcome to this channel. This next repair is a Sharp 4K Smart TV model LC45UA6800X. It turns on, and the image is ok but a segment of the backlight does not light up. It needs to replace the whole strip of the LED backlight. I'll show you how to replace it. If you're new to this channel and haven't subscribed, please subscribe now and push the notification bell so you never miss a video like this. So let's get started. I'll try to manipulate the lead driver but is not successful. It really needs to replace the lead backlights. The backlight of this TV is an edge type. It's hard to replace only the defective LED or replace it all one by one. So it needs to replace the whole strip of the backlights. Let's remove all parts to make the LCD panel free to remove. Let's put tape to hold the source board in place. Unlock the plat wire connector now and disconnect them later. Let's flip over the TV and start removing the LCD panel edge cover. Gently pry the edge cover. Be careful not to destroy these COFs.
Now the edge cover is finally removed. Make sure that the panel is not glued before removing it. Let's put it on the other table to use this table to lay the LCD panel later. Let's disconnect the source board from the T-Con gently. Then tape it like this to stay in place. Not too much bend to the COF for not destroying it. Now it's ready to separate the LCD panel. Carefully lay it on the table. The acrylic diffuser sheet is badly burnt and cracked. I don't have a replacement for this. Let's just continue replacing the lead backlights.
Try not to bend the acrylic diffuser sheet to prevent the crack to get bigger. These pieces of plastic also melt. This is the new LED edge backlight. It's came from China. Looks like this are original. Let's remove the old LED strips. and also remove the adhesive Now let's place the lead strip into position gently. Use cloth or tissue to press the lead strip to not contaminate it. Let's remove the burnt acrylic for somehow more light to pass to it. The acrylic diffuser sheet melts and the LED backlights are damaged due to the driver giving a high level of current to the LEDs for a long time.
When you bought a new TV, the setting is set into dynamic mode. Dynamic mode is where the backlight is at full level. If you don't change the setting to standard or set the backlight to about 70%, this will happen. The light is not spreading evenly and has a discoloration due to the burnt acrylic diffuser sheet even though we remove some of the burnt acrylic spots. A few moments later. The TV is working. The discoloration and the not evenly spreading of the light are so noticeable. But the outcome is acceptable. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed and have learned from my video. You can help this channel by your likes and subscribing to it. And ringing the notification bell to never miss a video like this. Once again I'm Tefs. See you in the next video. Bye for now.